Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019-2020 Panini Prism Basketball. Looks like we slashed the price of the last two teams too and they were pop picked up right away. Popped up right away? Picked up right away. Prism Basketball, six box, half case, pick a team number six from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Second half of the case right here. You can see Jason marked the six or was it me? I don't know. Jason, did you do five? Prism five? Anyway. There it is right there. So we all know they're from the same case. Marked there. Kind of slide these off this way. Here are the people involved in this break. There you go. Six box six. Prison basketball hobby edition on the 10th of December. And there's everybody right here. Thank you everyone for getting into the action. Really appreciate it. We got last spot mojo in this. I think it was Mark Matheson, right? I think he picked up the Knicks last. I think it was Mark Matheson. Yes, did get the Knicks. So, there's the last spot mojo star next to his name. Good luck to him and good luck to everybody. Knife. Now, this break should bring us pretty much to the top of the hour, ladies and gentlemen, which is the last hour of the broadcast. And we got to figure out what we want to do for that last hour of the broadcast. I think what the people want, if you're listening right now and just joined us, you're like, so what do the people want to do? I think the people want impeccable football. There's only a few teams left, two inexpensive teams and one expensive team, New York Giants. And I think the people also want to maybe do thread. That's more more my suggestion. Threads basketball is possibly another good way to end the night. And we'll have time for both. Let's see what's going on in the uh, basketball world today. We have got the Washington Wizards fell to the Charlotte Hornets. Hornets one fourteen, Wizards one oh seven. Philadelphia beat the Denver Nuggets 97-92. And in overtime, the Miami Heat took care of the Hawks 135-121. Only game in progress right now is the uh, Knicks at Portland. And Portland is cruising right now. They're up 64-41 at the beginning of the second half. Rough times for the Knicks. I thought the Knicks would be, the Knicks would be a little bit better. All right. There's Trey Young Silver, and I'm breezing by these red waves because um, because they're not numbered, but they will ship. Sorry, <laughs> Sorry. Just losing losing my train of thought there for a second. Kevin Huter, 25. R.J. Barrett, red wave. It's a big name in the hobby right here. Nice R.J. Barrett. Now in these in these products here, the parallels often, just like the non-autograph parallels are sometimes just as good as some of the autographs you can get in this set. Which is kind of wild. Jalen Brunson to 99. For the Mavs, Nick Claxton. We've got Boyan Bogdanovich and Derek Jones Jr. for the Heat. Nice. Um, there will be more, yes, Frank, of Upper Deck Buyback after it's open tomorrow when we get it delivered to us. Drops tomorrow. Nice one for the Heat. Now, R.J. Barrett goes to Mark Masson in the Knicks, by the way. And Derek Jones, Heat, that goes to Andrew Hennessy with that one. Yes, 
Jordan Poole for the Warriors to 199. Here's Derek Jones Jr. again. It's Isaiah Thomas Hyper. These aren't numbered, but luck of the lottery, DeAndre Hunter. Got Eric Bledsoe to two ninety nine. Andre Drummond Red Wave. Caboclo to two ninety nine. And Kobe Bryant right here. A couple of these sort of hyper parallels there. Those of course will ship. It's only veteran commons that won't ship. Like this guy. And Nasir Little for the Trailblazers. Is, your, is, he, is Nasir Little getting playing time? Let's look at the box score right here. That goes to Portland. That'll be for John Samuelson. Be good for the hobby. Hashtag good for the hobby if he was. Some, says Sean. Yeah, it's got a few minutes tonight. Nothing, nothing really going on, but a, but a few. Nice. All right, all right, let's... Let's get him worked in, Portland. That'll be hashtag good for the hobby. Ben Simmons Silver, nice. There's Casey Okpala, Silver. All right, that was box one. All right, and the next box. Yeah, if the Trail Bears keep blowing them out, yeah, get, get Nasir Little out there. Let's, let's increase his value in the hobby. That's what I say. How, how, did, the, uh, how did the Hatchimal do today, Sean? Looks like the Wizards did play today. For the box score. All right, 33 minutes, 18 points, 12 rebounds, and a couple assists. That's pretty good. A plus minus of, of minus 30, yeah, but that's which is not good. But he's still young. Can't really expect him to play defense. I was crunching some numbers yesterday, the other day, folks, just because that's what I do. Uh, the Wizards actually have a great offensive rating in basketball. I think they may be in the top five in offensive rating, but they're quite literally, I think, last in defensive rating. Something like that. So that's not good. They got to they gotta clean that up. But if they can clean that up. You think Hachimura, Rookie of the Year? A lot of competition this year. Although that John Morant injury, that John Morant injury, I think, could... Uh, could open open up that there he is right there, who's been playing excellent, but I think that could open up the rookie of the year race. Matisse Tybel, Silver, DeAndre Hunter, Red Wave, not numbered. There's Del Vadova to two ninety nine. John Morant. Zion. I mean, I don't know. Just the Zion hype might be so great that he would, maybe he, he can miss a couple first couple of months of the season, still win Rookie of the Year.
Reggie Jackson Silver and the autograph is Rudy Gay. San Antonio Spurs. That will be for William Hondard with the Spurs. Chris Middleton to 299. Nice. Aaron Bickham took the Browns. So does that leave just one team left? What about Tyler Hero? He's been playing some good basketball. How did he do today? Let's look at the box score there. Tyler Hero had, oh, not a good day for him. He's 23 minutes. In 23 minutes, 0 for 6 from the floor, 0 for 4 from 3. Zero points. One assist, one steal, two turnovers. That's not good. Bad day at the office for Tyler Hero. Ooh, Zion Silver. Hi-ho, Silver. Away. Pelicans, Jeremy Tillman with the Pelicans. Just this alone. Four, five, six hundred bucks. There you go. That is nice. Still haven't seen his eye on autograph. Out of the prism, but we've seen a number of those silvers, which have been great. It's R.J. Barrett. There's Victor Oladipo to 149. When's Oladipo coming back? Is he still working his way back from injury? What's going on there? And Sean says Tyler Hero's not even the best rookie on that team anymore. Chris Nunn? Is it Chris Nunn, I think? He's got 36 on the night, 36, 6, and 4 with a steal on 42 minutes. So maybe he's the new guy now, so I don't know. Adam's saying Depot still got some time. All right. I feel like the Pacers have actually been... Yeah, they're, they're 15 and 9 without Victor Oladipo. Once he comes back, it could be interesting. There's Gordon Hayward to 199. I mean, or actually, you just keep keep giving give Oladipo as much time as he needs. Pacers are fifteen and nine without him. You know, they're kind of right in the middle of the pack of the Eastern Conference playoff race. Still extremely early. There's Eric Paschal or Pascal or Paschal, fifteen out of twenty five. Nice Mojo refractor for the Warriors. That'll be for Jeffrey Laboda. There's Hachimura. We're just talking about him. There he is. Yeah, that'd be great opening up another sort of Asian international market. He's a Japanese international. Be pretty big. That goes to Evan and the Wizards. 20 out of 25. Nice jaw Morant right here. Those are the uh, hyper parallels or something like that, right? Very nice. All right. Next box. Um, who's got the Grizzlies in this? Ken Goldberg has the Grizz. There you go, Ken. Who are some surprising teams? I guess in a good or a bad way. Who are some surprising teams to you? I think I thought that the... I'll be honest with you. I'll, I'll, I can admit when I'm wrong. I thought the Bucks didn't do enough in the offseason. But they're, they've got a 15-game winning streak. 
They're 21 and 3 on the season, which is crazy. The Celtics are playing a lot better than I thought they would. Heat as well. I think everything else, I think they're pretty. Yeah, I think Pacers without Oladipo, I think playing better than I thought they would. I think the. Uh, let's see. I thought the Wizard. I thought the Hawks would be better than their record reflects at this stage of the season. Six and eighteen for the Hawks. I thought they would be better. I mean, I didn't think they'd have 21 wins or anything like crazy like that, but I thought they'd be 500 at this stage of the season, at least. Uh, yeah, all the silvers get, get, get sleeved and top-loaded before they go out. Kevin Love to 149. Josh Richardson, Jared Allen. We got Mo Bamba, Mojo to 25 for the Orlando Magic. They're playing some decent ball too. All right, and whoa, Zion Williamson autograph. Got it. Got him. Jeremy Tillman. Great break for you. You got the silver Zion, and now you have the Zion auto. Nice. Yeah, makes up, makes up for all those Pelicans that you've been picking up, Jeremy. Nice. A strong hit right there. Yep, Michael. Yeah, silver and an auto. Can you believe that? It's John Wall to 199. There's T Mac, Tracy McGrady, silver. Darius Brazley. Isn't that... That's how wild the silvers are. Bye, Mike. Quinn Cook, silver. Another Zion insert right here. Far out insert. Which I'm sure will be like another like 30 bucks or something like that. Something wild like that. Zion should be coming back pretty soon, ladies and gentlemen. I think a week or two. In a week or in a week or two, we should see Zion back in action, which will be a huge boost for the Pelicans. Which will be a nice little boost for the hobby. Anthony Davis Silver, Kyle Kuzma. Zach Collins to 299. PJ Washington, KG Silver, and Jason Kidd autograph. Yeah, nice. Mavs, Brian Lentz. With old Jason Kidd, assistant coach for the Lakers right now. Breathing down Frank Vogel's neck, just in case Frank Vogel slips up. All right, Steph Curry in the back right there, just in case. Well, Frank Vogel is really, I'm a Lakers guy, Frank Vogel really kind of changed the defensive nature of that team, which has been, been lacking in the last uh, couple years. Um... Surprising teams, good and bad, surprising. 
Good surprise, bad surprise. Western Conference. Lakers. I didn't. I, I thought the Lakers would take a little more. Would take them a little more time to gel, both defensively and offensively. But they're twenty-one and three. In fact, I think they may. They may run into the Milwaukee Bucks soon. Right, they're at Magic. And I think the next game, maybe? Where's their schedule? At No, they're not for a little bit, but at Magic on the 11th, at Miami. Wow, that's, it's a brutal road trip. At Atlanta, at Indiana. And then on December 19th, Thursday the 19th, they're at Milwaukee. It's a TNT game. I mean, both teams may not have losses up to that point. So that would be crazy. See you, Jackie. And so... That, that's going to be a pretty incredible matchup. But I didn't think the, the Lakers' defense would, would appear so, so I guess, so strongly, so well. Everyone, I knew the offense was going to be there, but the defense has been great. Uh, that doesn't even come out till tomorrow, Noah, so we can't do it tonight. Buybacks. Jason is going live early for that buyback tomorrow, though. Around 11.30. L.A. time, 12, about a couple hours earlier than we normally go on air. So, oh, yeah, he'll, he'll even break that Bowman, too, if it sells out, that Bowman 12. All right, see you, no. See you tomorrow, man. All right, three boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. I think that Impeccable did indeed sell out. Nice, it is sold out, so let's officially add that to the schedule. So we have about a half hour time slot to fill with a break if you'd like. I think a good break would be maybe that Threads break. Chase Kobe Bryant autographs in those special Jaspi packs that we made for everybody. Carlos Boozer, Cavs, sensational signatures. That's going to go to Joe Parisi who got the Cavs in a team random, which is in a separate video before I started this break, right? Did I upload that? I did. Carlos Boozer going your way. It's Goran Dragic to two ninety nine. Steven Adams, Jackson Hayes. Bam out of bio silver, Myers Leonard. What up, Brett? What's going on? This is Kyrie Silver, Tyler Johnson. Mike Scott to 199, 188 out of 199 for the Sixers. Seku Domboya, that is, 86 out of 99 for the Pistons. KD for the Nets. Cam Reddish, rookie. Patrick Ewing to 299. Chandler Parsons. Paul Pierce, Silver, Etwan Moore, Giannis Antetokounmpo, Silver insert. Wow. And a purple cracked ice Zion Williamson for Jeremy Tillman. When it rains, it pours.
<laughs> what, Sean? Um, 75 out of 140. Wish Joe would freshen it up and just toss in an accent. So what kind of accent do you want? I can do some pretty bad accents. But I don't want I don't want to off offend anybody. There's Mafondu, Cabanelli, Clippers. I just maybe I should just watch some more Downton Abbey and I can get a passable English accent going. Clip show. Andrew Hennessy once again got the Clippers in a team random. Two boxes go. When polled, um, when Brits were polled ages ago, they were like, which American act actor did the worst British accent? It was overwhelmingly Dick Van Dyke and Mary Poppins. No, I, I don't know how to do, do a Jersey accent. Can't do that. Southern accent would not be able to do. So no, not not good at any of those. I need to watch more Gone with the Wind. Savannah. Do 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 do. When's the last time you guys seen Gone with the Wind, ladies and gentlemen? It's a pretty long movie. Pretty epic though. It's pretty good. Pretty good. So it would just mostly be me doing lines from Gone with the Wind. Fiddle DD -dee -dee and whatnot. That's all I got. Next one. I don't know. Maybe, maybe if I if I work on Boxing Day, Sean, I can I can drop a drop an English accent there. Stay tuned for the twenty sixth of December. <laughs> True holiday. Well, Joe will do an entire break in a semi passable English accent. Malcolm Brogdon Silver, Trevor Ariza, and we got Royce O'Neal for the Jazz. Mark Matheson got the Jazz in a team random. Get another John. Might as well save a John Moran. Another one of those. It's the silvers that have the big, the big, big boom in value. But so will these. A little bit. Wes Matthews, forty-one out of ninety-nine. Darius Baisley, KCP. Wilt Chamberlain to 299. Kobe. LeBron James, fireworks silver. That's pretty nice. I've been told that these LeBron Jameses for this year have been doing pretty well because it's his first time in a Lakers jersey. Remember last year's was still in his Cavs jersey, but it would go to the Lakers, right? This time, finally in his Lakers gear. So there's some value there for Neil, who picked up my Lakers. Got Marcus Morris, Jarrett Culver, Isaiah Roby. Isaiah Roby to Isaiah Thomas to 75. 
De Junta Murray. And behind Jaleel Okafor is Zion's teammate, Nikhil Alexander Walker. What a break for the Pels. Brad, you want to get your hands on some Bowman? Nice. Well, we're kind of out of time for Bowman tonight, but we'll definitely be breaking a couple more cases of it tomorrow, I'm sure. Get in. Get in while supplies last. Michael Porter Jr., Silver. Another R.J. Barrett, Anthony Davis to 149. Anthony Davis may, may be in line for Defensive Player of the Year. Oladipo Silver. And next box, last box coming up. And then Impeccable will be right after this. And then we're trying to figure out what we can fit into that 9.30-ish time slot. Because we can squeeze in one more quick break. I think really the best option I th would probably be that Threads break. I'll drop the link in the chat. Maybe one of those number blocks, perhaps a translucent break. Those are a couple of quick breaks right there, too. Black Diamond Hockey, one box, random team break, that prime racing. So there are some options on quick options on the site where we can do uh, do a couple of those. Yeah, the hands have been a little sore, I'll be honest with you, yeah. But I would have done if if twelve fit in if uh, pick your team twelve. If we had time for it, I would have done it. I think after a couple, uh, after a couple super jumbos and a jumbo, people's appetite for for draft kind of waned a little bit. Yeah, I can't imagine Cup not going tomorrow. Cup hockey, that should go. I think when another round of hockey fans wake up in the morning, Brandon, they'll be like, "Hey, hey, that's pretty close." They'll, they'll get some teams. That should help move it along. Jason will be live early, too. So I'm sure with buybacks coming out tomorrow, they'll just be a little extra, a little extra like, hey, some hockey, extra hockey in the air. Hockey spirit in the air. Last pack of the last box. This is Pick Your Team 6. I think we have some more Prism in the store, so check it out. We've got Hobby Editions, Retail ed re Hobby Pick Your Teams, like this break. Retail Editions, we've got the Basketball Mixers. A ton of value. A ton of secondary market value in basketball, boys and girls. So give it a shot. Give it a go. All right, good luck, everyone. There's Larry Nance Jr., Silver, and Jared Culver for the Timberwolves. Nice autograph for the T-Wolves. That's going to go to David Bruins. We got Zaire Smith to 99, Blue Cracked Ice. Team Olajuwon. Hamadou Diallo, Silver. Bismarck Biombo, Tyler Hero. Andre Iguodala for the Grizz to 199. Donovan Mitchell, John Morant, luck of the lottery. We'll save one of those.
and Jalen Horde for John Samuelson and the Trailblazers. Sensational signatures. Jonathan Isaac, Red Wave. Rudy Gay, and the silver is Davidis Servetus. Silver rookie for the Pistons. Scotty Pippen, red. 162 to 299. Nikola Vucevic. Cam Reddish, silver for the Hawks. That's going to go to Josh Reich. Nice one for the Hawks. And our last little bit here, what do we got? Jalen Brunson Mojo, that's the 25. Chris Dunn. Zion Williamson, just base. What a, what a, what a break for Jeremy Tillman and the Pelicans. Pretty nice stuff, Jeremy. Appreciate you getting in time and time again. Rewarded big time tonight. There's Alfonso, Alfonso McKinney to 299. Zaire Smith, Donovan Mitchell, and Jimmy Butler at the end. And there you have it. That was Half Case Hobby edition of 2019 2020 Panini Prison Basketball. Pick your team number six from jazpyscasebreaks.com. Appreciate everybody getting in. This is Joe. We'll break more with you next time. Bye bye.